guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be reacting to another BTS Speaking English. It has been a while since I've done a BTS Speaking English video. I think it's been about four months or something. And I personally love these type of videos. If you have been on my channel for a while or since my previous one or basically any video. Because I think I mention it in basically every video that they speak English in. Their broken English is the cutest thing in the entire world and I will never get sick of it. I could watch the same video on loop for 50 hours of them just speaking like broken English and I will adore it and cherish it with my whole heart because it's the cutest thing ever and even though like Namjoon is fluent in English I still love hearing him speak it because his like his voice when he goes from like Korean to English it's like his Korean voice is kind of like normal casual his English voice is so attractive and deep it's kind of weird because I feel like if you don't speak Korean you don't really actually hear what their actual voice sounds like talking wise until they speak English like even like I feel like uh, it's hard to explain but I'm sure people understand what I mean like you don't really hear what their actual like talking voice is until they speak English maybe some people are going to be like Gina stop being a crackhead you can hear them speak in Korean but like some people will understand what I mean <laughs> uh, oh I love this I love this woman I miss you too get that fluent English who is your Hollywood crush? Blake Lively. Actress. Blake Lively. I know she's married, but Brad Pitt. I said this in another video where June was like, Blake Lively, but she's married. I'm not married. I mean. Scale is international playboy. Don't ask me in English, please. <laughs> The run error is my weakness. I don't know if I've ever said this, but the run error is my all-time favorite error. Like, Yoongi's mint hair, the outfits, the, like, Doc Martens, which are, like, my favorite shoes, by the way. I have a pair. Not, I don't have a real pair. I have a fake pair. Because, girl, I ain't paying, like, £130 for a pair of shoes. Um, I have a fake pair, and I basically live in them. And, like, they're just Jimin's orange hair, like, Hobie's black hair, just... July. <laughs> Come on. It's not July. <laughs> BTS is my favorite pilot. <laughs> I love getting on a plane and BTS just taking me to my destination. Jimin was 18. Jimin was the same age as me here. Where are the boys? Where I live? The same age as me that look like this. <laughs> Brother. Oh, I you guys twins. Really? What? Twins. <laughs> to be fair though, like if you not so much now, but if you look at them when Jim how old was Jungkook? Brother. Oh, I you guys 16. So he said it was 16 there. If you look at them two together like at this age when he was 18, when Jimin was 18, Jungkook was 16, they do look very similar. Like, I wouldn't say twins, but they could definitely be related. Brother. Oh, I you guys twins. Really? What? What? Oh, that reminds me of Omega. What is that one film where, like, whenever you say something to him, he's like, what? I'll put a little clip here. <laughs> Bad boy. I love this interview. Why did you say it like an English word? Grimshilio. <laughs> it kind of does sound English when he says it like that. <laughs> what a perfect English. No memories. <laughs> 
I was very noisy in school. See, like, I love you, Tay, but you were the kind of person that would annoy me at school. I go to school and I just want to get an education. I don't want kids screaming in my ear. I don't want kids running into me. I don't want kids pushing me. I go there to learn. I don't need anyone interacting with me. <laughs> you are still like that. <laughs> what was that interview? I've never seen that before. I think Jimin sounds the cutest. So exciting to see our fans. I love you, Ami. So it's right now. I don't know if it's just me, but I can always imagine them like sat in like a room together, like before they go on tour, or not on tour, but before they just go to any country that isn't Korea or that speaks English. And I can just imagine them like. Sorry, I just looked at the way Jimin is like doing the heart to the camera, and it like made my heart like. <laughs> um, but I can just imagine them like sitting around like together and like June just being like right this is how you say this and they're, they're just like trying to memorize it because I remember I think it was Tay he said that they do memorize stuff like when they go to like English countries and I think that's the cutest thing ever Jimin's like <laughs> oh this isn't my video I just watched <laughs> go boom boom <laughs> Is it bad? I don't know who that is. Maybe I do. I haven't watched this either. Yeah! Was this in Korea? Favorite? <laughs> Oh, the iconic beach. <laughs> Tastes like, huh? <laughs> I'm bad boy. <laughs> We're sure you are. Inspires, man, yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be really awkward if they don't show that bit now. There it is. <laughs> Inspire. Oh no, please don't play this. This has been so awkward, no. Start. Oh. What are you going to do with the girlfriend issue? Jin's like, I have girls left, right, and center who want me. I can just take my pick. <laughs> yes! Like, like I didn't know there was a Korean accent. Like, you know how when Chinese, I'm just gonna use Chinese as an example. When Chinese people try to speak English who aren't like properly fluent in it, they have like a Chinese accent. I never knew there was like a Korean accent until I like started watching BTS. Like then, instead of saying and, where he goes and the, like because they Korean is quite not a harsh language, but they do have some vocabulary that is pretty harsh when you have to say it. So I think that's why they do that. <laughs> Let's pop in. There's so much leg in that picture. <laughs> He's a legend every day. I would love to interview them. Like, I couldn't. I literally couldn't. I would not be able to speak in front of them. Like, I... No, I could not do that. But, like... In my dreams, if I was like really confident, I would love to interview them. Like I, th I think 
they'd just be so fun to interview like if I got 30 minutes to like interview them and like play like a fun game with them or something I would love that I couldn't do that because I'm way too shy but Manhattan if you could rename yourselves what did that say if you could rename yourselves with an English stage name, what would it be? Okay. He's from Busan. Seagull is their official word. Okay. Oh, Justin Seagull? <laughs> I never knew that's where that came from. Jack. Weirdly though, I oh, sorry, I need to stop pausing. Weirdly, he looks like a Jack. Like, he's like, sorry, we're just, this is us. Like, this is, <laughs> I felt so bad for him, but it was so funny. Shit down. <laughs> Please do. <laughs> Boy, you're looking fine here. I'm a bogo dalachi. Do we do the bottom of she? On a sedan and catch a kid and hang it down. Why are you guys? <laughs> He's like, mm -hmm. <laughs> Milk. Milk. <laughs> by the way, the way, oh, that scrolled way too far back. The way Jung goes, milk. <laughs> oh no, wait, how does he say it again? Hold on, let me get it back to the right, but I went way too far back. He's like, milk. <laughs> it was so cute. Like, it was so quiet and cute. Milk. <laughs> Pant Express. I've seen them, like, say happy birthday to all the members since they started, like, saying that they like them. <laughs> Tate's laughing. so cute. <laughs> Are you nervous? Yes. <laughs> I would be, if I was one of them and I was the first K-pop group to perform at like an American and watch other that, I would be pooing my pants before I went on, like. <laughs> How do you go to the market if you have a bunch of young people that know you? I guess you just have to send someone else to go shop for you, obviously, right? Our manager will bring our item. Good for him. Thank God for that. Alright. Oh, please don't. These, these bits are so cringy. The way she says it so completely like Jimini <laughs> Babo like bitch <laughs> What's his goal like to just tell as many people that word? Our friend Sami, you made all of this possible. Beautiful. Okay, so that was my reaction to Beatus speaking English. Like I said, it had been a while since I'd done any kind of video that in involved them like speaking English. And because they did go to the AMAs and we had like a whole bunch of them speaking English there because it was in America, it was just the cutest thing ever. I would honestly, I like, I really want them to come to a British awards show or just something where they can be interviewed in Britain. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If there's any more videos like this that you want me to react to, feel free to leave it in the comments below or send it on Instagram or Twitter or anything like that. Also, make sure you like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.
하루든 을새어봐 혹시 널 하는 마음에 또하